Welcome back ladies and gentlemen Today we're gonna have a quick look at a match between Big Daddy Cool Diesel in his prime up against John Morrison Sometimes I think it'd be really cool to see how these matches would have played out So without further ado, let's get into it And here we go and Morrison wasting no time going after Diesel. He knows if he's going to beat this big guy, he can't let him get the upper hand. He's going to take him down and keep him down. That's exactly what he's doing here. Heading up to the top rope already. What's he got in mind? Comes down with a Hurricane Rana. Takes Diesel back down to the mat. Then the springboard. Now a few kicks to the back. Then he brings him back down to the mat with the arm drag. Diesel back in control. Slams Morrison down on his face. Then goes straight after that back. You got a bad back. It's hard to fly. Diesel one, arguably one of the best big men that this sport has ever seen. John Morrison... I think he's been extremely underutilized by WWE. He is so talented in what he does. No one can move around the ring the way that he does. And I think he really deserved to have had a lot better run with bigger matches in WWE. But that's why we're here today, folks. As it goes for the cover. One, two, and Diesel kicks out. Diesel back with the grapple, but... Morrison counters, dragging him away from the ropes, what's he got in mind? Very fancy leg drop, that's the way he does it, he's back up on the top rope, Morrison launches, brings that elbow down, he's got Diesel stunned, is this it already? One, two, and no, Diesel just gets that shoulder up. Morrison not happy with the count, thought he could have gone a bit faster. Standing moonsault. He's keeping Diesel down, but Diesel catches that leg and rips it off at the hip. Just the way that Diesel does it. And he's got him by the neck. Here we go. Choke slam. He's gone for the cover. One, two, and Morrison kicks out this time. One thing Morrison needs to do is stay away from the power bomb. Here we go, He's setting up for the jackknife. This could be it. Morrison, no. Punching his way out of it. Lucky for Morrison. That could have been it right there. Diesel with the vicious headbutt sends him down. Diesel going to the top rope. You don't see this very often. Comes down with the elbow and completely misses. Morrison had that one scouted. And the inverted DDT straight to the mat. Morrison back up to the top rope again. He's going for it again and completely misses. Diesel likewise has that one scouted. And another headbutt. Stomping on that arm. He's going to break that in a minute. Just picks Morrison up by the head. Throws him across the ring like he's nothing. Morrison with the backbreaker and the Russian leg sweep takes him down he's yanking at that arm trying to separate that shoulder he's going for the pin surely that's not going to be enough one two and the shoulder comes up again Diesel a bit slow on that on kicking out of that one he might be a bit more hurt than we think he is big knee to the head that's going to knock anybody down Going back after the shoulder again. Kick to the back. Straight into the kidneys. That's going to hurt. There we go. Another leg drop. Standing moonsault. And into the pin. One, two, three. He's done it. He's beaten Diesel. Unbelievable. Credit where credit's due. John Morrison wins the match, beats the Hall of Famer. Have to admit, I didn't think he was going to do it that easily, but he got the job done. That's it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like and sub. 
You know the deal, and we'll catch you in the next one.